Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Dean, a photographer and researcher here at IDB Pro Photo, a channel that's dedicated to everything photography. Guys, I hope you enjoyed watching that little clip. Uh, that's our model for the day, Sinova. She's come all the way from Norway, guys. Yes, you heard me right, from Norway. Uh, so yes, but before we get into it, guys, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Uh, I know you're probably looking at me and thinking, why the hell is this guy wearing a suit to a photo shoot? <clears throat> well, I'm looking at you and thinking, isn't that none of your business? <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, so yes, I'm wearing a suit because I've got a business meeting straight after my shoot with Sinova in Leeds. So I thought I might as well just kill two birds with one stone. There we go. So yes, so that's why I'm suited and booted. So anyway, I'm getting ready to drive about an hour and a half to Leeds, uh, which is where I'm going to be meeting Sinova at the Royal Armouries. Uh, so I've had a look at the weather and it's a bit of a mixed bag really. So we're looking at sunshine, rain, wind, clouds, and not to mention very cold. Uh, so yeah, a bit of a lucky dip really. I don't know what to expect. So. Uh, I'm thinking uh, I'm not gonna bother taking any flashes or anything like that. I'm just gonna shoot natural light. Uh, I think that should work. Uh, so yeah, I also plan to use my uh, Sigma 105 millimeter f1.4 art lens. I've had this lens for a few months now. And to be honest, I don't think I've used it half as much as I'd want to. So I think to force myself to use it, I'm just gonna take only one lens today. I'm gonna leave my 35 millimeter f1.4 again sigma art lens uh, because what i tend to find is uh, i usually tend to bring that lens for the ride anyway um because i'm so comfortable using that lens because it's so easy to use i tend to forget the 105 millimeters so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna leave that lens here at home and that's gonna force me to use the 105 all day so yes at the end of the video i'll give you some feedback um my thoughts really about how um about what i think about the lens usability blah 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 all that stuff if you're considering uh getting the 105 millimeter f 1.4 sigma lens hopefully that might help you make a decision so wait a minute before i set off guys uh, i just want you to cast your eyes on this bad boy here for a minute if i can get it if i can get it up uh so yes look at this bad boy here this is uh the tarion um extra large camera bag. Now, usually when I go on photo shoots, I take two bags, run about same size as those bags at the back there. So I tend to take uh, two bags just to fit all my gear. But I found this bad boy on Amazon. It's only about 70 quid, I think it was. And it takes everything. Like literally all my flashes, my two cameras, my lenses. Honestly, it's just like a bottomless pit. Like literally eats everything. Uh, so yes, I'll probably do like a video later on, maybe like a what's in my bag type thing uh, and do a little mini review of this bag. But to be honest, guys, I'm really, really impressed with this bag and I would highly, highly recommend it. If you're on the market for a decent camera bag, guys, this, you will fall in love with this, guys. So yeah, uh, so yes, I'm all packed up, guys, ready to go. So what's left for me to do is jump in the car and go do some shooting. So guys buckle up and let's go have some fun <sighs> yes uh turn me up let's get this back down Jesus. it is rather huge i'll we'll just um i'll take a few on here so maybe if you kind of stand like sort of like in the middle yeah Maybe about here, yep. and I'll see if I can shoot maybe yeah, from. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. We, we can just do a mix of that, that and waste that. Yeah, it looks gorgeous. Perfect. Yeah, that looks really good. Love it. Right, I'm just gonna get a little bit closer.
so there you go guys thank you thank you for sticking around and watching this video i hope you enjoyed this uh, photo shoot just as much as i did honestly i just want to thank Sinova for being amazing so yes guys if you're looking for a model it's very reliable good attitude very experienced Sinova is definitely the one to go for uh, i will share Sinova's uh, instagram handle down in the description guys go and give uh, this model a follow she's very 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 amazing honestly you won't be disappointed and if you can afford her definitely work with this model she's absolutely fantastic so yes for a shoe honestly i couldn't have asked for a better for a shoe uh, everything went to plan uh, i you know i was a little bit worried because i've heard a lot of things about uh the security guards around the uh, the royal armories in leeds but i didn't have any problems uh we just shot and we didn't get any issues with anybody um <clears throat> you know apparently usually they've got an issue with photographers um because if you've got a tripod or flash you're classed as professional anyway hey, like i say we didn't have any problems had a really good shoot uh the weather wasn't too bad yes it was sunny cloudy sunny cloudy so i decided to just put my camera in aperture priority uh because you know, I just didn't want to mess about too much, you know, changing all the manual settings while Sinova just stood there in the freezing cold. So I just had to think of a way to shoot really quickly. All I, all I had to do was just focus on shooting and just mind my aperture. And that was it. Uh, so yes, what do I think of the Sigma 105mm f1.4 art lens? Honestly, oh my God, guys. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say, guys. Guys, this lens is to die for this lens is the dream honestly if you've got a little bit of spare money honestly take it from me guys invest in this lens this lens is amazing so i took in the region of you know 300 to 400 photographs i think on the day and i can hand on heart say every single image was in focus i'm talking eye autofocus eye focus here I ought to focus yes well that's a different story because the the sony a7r2 is a beast the the best camera in my opinion that sony has ever made i mean i've had lots of sony cameras and this camera honestly i don't have a need to upgrade to any other sony camera in the next 10 years i think this camera is just amazing like literally paired up with the sigma 105 millimeter lens they, they're like this amazing couple honestly they just just work so well together um i know this uh sigma 105 gets a lot of bad press about it you know the sheer size the size and the weight i'm not gonna lie it is a bit of a big boy a bit of a chunky boy but you know what the benefits by far outweigh the issues about the size and the, the weight like seriously every single photo is just amazing i've really really enjoyed uh shooting with this lens literally every single click was just like oh, oh. <sighs> honestly so this thing is sharp wide open and f 1.4 all the way down to f 12 whatever you name it honestly this thing is amazing absolutely loved it so yes that's my verdict that's what i think of this lens moving forward i need to shoot with this lens a bit more honestly absolutely loved it so guys thank you so much for watching and if you don't already do be sure to hit that subscribe button and those notification bells so i can let you know every single time when i upload new content if you're a model or another photographer or creative individual and you'd like to work with me be sure to find me on instagram idb pro photos like right there drop me a note guys and let's see if we can work together and potentially break the internet so guys thank you so much for watching until next time keep shooting thank you <laughs>